So we all know that in this day and age, fitness has gone digital. And with big names like Peloton, Mirror, and Hydro, you are required to buy a big heavy piece of machinery and a subscription. But what if you're like me and you actually enjoy going to the gym and you have nowhere in your house to place a big heavy bike or treadmill? What if there was something that serves as an all-in-one training, coaching, and music app that all you have to do is bring it with you to the gym and you have everything at the palm of your hand? Well, I think I found that app and it's my ultimate favorite. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how I stay motivated with the app Fit Radio. Hey everybody, it's Michelle West here and welcome back to my channel where I create videos to help inform, motivate, and inspire you to get up, move, and live a healthier life. If you're returning to my channel, welcome back. But if you're new to my channel and you love fitness-focused content, make sure you hit that subscribe button and tap that bell so you know when I drop a new video. In today's video, we're gonna talk about my all-time favorite fitness app, Fit Radio. I swear to you, I use this app every single day when I'm in the gym. And Fit Radio is an an all-in-one fitness and coaching app that focuses on providing upbeat and motivational music to help drive you through your workout. The reason why I downloaded it in the first place is because I was looking for more music apps that I could use that drive me and motivate me through the gym. Now, I do like Mixcloud and I do like Spotify, but the reason why I love Fit Radio so much is that there are DJ mixes that last about an hour to an hour and a half long. I want it to feel like a club when I'm at the gym, if that makes sense. <laughs> So in this video, I'm gonna share with you some of my favorite features about Fit Radio, why I love the app so much, and stick with me till the end of the video and I'm gonna give you some of my favorite DJs that are on the app and my favorite trainers. You should know that I am not sponsored by Fit Radio. I pay for my own subscription and if Fit Radio wants to hire me to be a coach one day, that would be great. So the one thing that I love about this app is that it's very easy to use. There's only three sections that you have to worry about and that's music, cardio coaching, and strength training. Now, when you first open up the app, it comes right on the music screen. Now, on the music screen, you will find all different types of music selections to choose from. You'll find all your DJs, you'll find music by activity, you'll find genres, and you'll even find cardio tempo runs. So if you're on the treadmill and you know that you're gonna run a eight minute mile, you can actually choose DJ mixes that are going to stay on that beats per minute for your eight minute mile. There are literally so many DJ mixes that you can choose from on this front page. And if you scroll down a little bit and find trainer series, you'll find a DJ mix that I collaborated with one of the DJs on the app. It'll say Michelle West, and you can use this on your next workout. Another thing I wanna point out is if you just wanna listen to the DJ mix and you don't wanna have any cardio coaching or strength training coaching on top of your music, you can just choose the music and do your own workout in the gym. That's what I love. You can kind of separate the two. But I'll tell you one of my flaws about this app at the end <laughs> of the video. My next feature that I absolutely love that keeps me motivated is on the second page and that is the cardio page. Now, I can't tell you how much that this part of the app keeps me motivated to run miles and miles and miles on the treadmill. And I have so many friends who always reach out to me that say, how are you running so long without getting bored? This is the reason why. Because I love coaching so much and it fuels me with the energy and the competitive spirit that I have to keep going, I need that coach in my ear to tell me keep going, keep going, keep going. So the coaching is absolutely amazing. On the top row on that second page, you'll find all of the coaches and on the bottom section of the app, you'll find cardio coaching, outdoor runs, treadmill, rower, stair climber, core, so many different things, check it out. And when I first downloaded this app, I only was using it for outdoor runs because all of the gyms were closed. So if you look in the outdoor run section, you'll find a ton of different programs that keep you motivated on your runs. I'm telling you guys, this is the reason why I can run the miles that I run. Also the reason why my pace has gotten faster and my distance has gotten longer. 
this is the section to take a look at. Now, my third favorite feature about this app is the strength training. If you look on the bottom, it's the third section. And on this section, you will find a bunch of different programs that you can follow in the gym right now that come with the subscription. They're about four to eight weeks long. And right now I'm doing Nikki Monticetti's body sculpt program and I am on week three. Now in my previous video, I told you that I gained about 10 pounds over the month of December. So I'm using this program on Fit Radio to reset and get back on my fitness journey. Another thing I love to do to keep me motivated is to let the trainers know that I'm doing their programs. And surprisingly, a lot of the trainers on this app are very active on social media. So what I'll do is I will post my results in my story, I'll tag the trainer, and most of the time, they will get back to me and say, yeah, girl. Oh my gosh. Look at that hard work that you're doing. It's so lit and it really does keep me accountable. So something you can try. Another cool feature about this app is when you go into a strength training section, on the bottom, you'll find an interval timer. If you click that, you can set how many rounds, how many sets, how much time that set is and the rest that you need in between. Honestly, most of the trainers that are on there are revolving their workouts around this feature. So it's really cool that you can have an interval timer that'll beep right in your ear and you don't have to go back and forth from your regular clock on your iPhone. Okay, so now I have to do this. And these are some of the features that I wish that Fit Radio would improve on on the app because no app is perfect. So Fit Radio, if you're watching this, this is for you. Number one. When I am training on my app and I get out of my app and go onto my Instagram to record myself at the gym doing a workout, most of the time the app will crash. Oh, I hate that. So when the app crashes, you have to go back and reset everything that you just did meaning go back into your strength training section and go and find the music that you were just listening to and it repeats all the way back to the top. I hate that. And number two, you cannot listen to the coaching without the music. Now you can do that vice versa. You can listen to the music without the coaching, but you can't do it the opposite way. There are some times that I would like to listen to a podcast or listen to some like softer music on my runs. It just depends on the day. And it would be really nice if I had that coaching feature, but I could listen to my own music of choice or podcast of choice. So that's something that I wish that they could improve on. Fit Radio, is that an option? Earlier in the video, I told you that I would share with you my favorite DJs and favorite trainers on Fit Radio. And here they are. Let's start with the DJs. DJ Dynamics, he's my absolute favorite and he is the DJ that I collaborated with on the trainer series. If you love trap, hip hop music, upbeat, and let's go, uh, uh, uh. He's the DJ to go for. I also love DJ Miss M, DJ, Role Model is on there and DJ Steady 130. Now I'll share with you some of my favorite trainers. Honestly, Fit Radio does a good job with hiring their trainers, so great job Fit Radio. But here are some of my favorites. Nikki Monacetti, Mike Bradshaw, Taz Tucker, Bianca, Seth, Heron, SysFit. Oh, I love SysFit. Now all of these great features you can get in Fit Radio for a simple subscription. Now I know that you're like, oh my gosh, Michelle, I have to pay for this app. But trust me, if you compare it to Peloton, Mirror, and Hydro, you don't have to pay for a big heavy piece of machinery and a subscription. All you're doing here is paying for a subscription and going to your gym or working out at home. So that is how I stay motivated with my favorite fitness and music app, Fit Radio. If you like the features that I talk about in the app and you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up, download the app, and let me know down in the comments how you like it. If you have any other apps that keep you motivated on your fitness journey, let me know below and I'll be sure to try it out. Thank you all so much for watching this video and I hope to see you on the next one. Bye.